here's my experiment set up. As you can see, it's a propane tank. I have modified the valve to take a Schrader valve. That's for measuring my uh, pressure. I had a old propane line off a trailer that I tied a quick connect into. Adapted that to a garden hose to fill up with water. So my whole idea is I'm going to open this valve and fill the tank up with water and uh, bleed the air off that's going to build inside because the volume being displaced. And I'm going to measure how much water I have using my scale here. And then I'm going to fill up the tank and drain the water. So I'll start filling it. If you can hear that, but it's starting to fill up. And the weight should increase. So here's some of my workings. Uh, that right there is how how much the tank holds. That's it in cubic meters. So I'm gonna fill it up. 22 liters so that will leave 10 liters for air and then I'm going to pressurize it to 10 bar drain the water off and here's what I should get once I drain all the water off That's, that should be the pressure drop there Okay, I'm not sure you'll be able to hear this, but you can see, you can hear the um, water displacing the air. So I can get the Schrader there. Not sure you can hear that, the air coming out. Slowly filling up. And we're almost at 20. Yep. Okay, so here's uh, the sketchy part. We're going to fill the approximately 10 liters of air, not fill it, but pressurize it to 10 bar, max this thing out. Okay, so this is open. And we're starting. Slowly start bleeding in the air. Okay, next fun part, it's not quite at 10 bar, so I'm going to start the air compressor up and uh, fill it more.
see it slowly building. Good five minutes or so. Yeah, so we're at 10 bar. Looks like she shut off in a second now. Shut this valve here. Shut this valve. And it's a little over ten, so we'll move some down a bit. All right, and we're going to start draining the water out of it. All right, so I got my tank here upside down. Basically allow the air pressure to blow out the water. And we're still at 10 bar. So let's... Uh, Kind of the uh, slow and boring part, draining out all the water. Need to push open a valve. I'll leak out. Okay, quick update. My hand's freezing, and uh, we are losing pressure. So we should should be almost empty based off that pressure right there. So let's continue. All right, so all the water has been drained out, and our pressure is a little under three bar. It's like a two and a half bar somewhere around there. So it's pretty close to what I was expecting. I wish it was a little closer, but. Is what it is. Okay, so here are my final calculations. There's uh, original one of the pressure before I started draining water. Uh, the actual pressure after. That's what I read on the gauge, two point seven. Volume before, volume after. That's how I calculated the, uh, like the volume beforehand. I just took away the total volume from that. And uh, here's the theoretical. And that's what I got. So not bad. Very close to the actual. Very happy with that.